Nurmagomedov putting his unbeaten record on the line against Michael Johnson. Here we go. The Southpaw Johnson in the white trunks. Nurmagomedov in the black trunks. Very fast hands from Michael Johnson. And Nurmagomedov, one of the best grapplers in the business. Michael Johnson coming off a spectacular finish of Dustin Poirier. That was back a sensational in September, performance. Joe. Yeah, it really and, was. And there was a lot of emotions on the line between those two fighters. There was a lot of talk back and forth, a lot of trash talk. This has been very different. Both guys have been very respectful in preparation for this fight. And even in their stare downs, been smiling, shaking hands, looking forward to just testing their skills with no shenanigans. Remember Gomedov, born and raised in Dagestan, Russia. Trains in San Jose. He's a member of the American Kickboxing Academy team. Of course, that's Daniel Cormier, Luke Rockhold, and company. And one thing to take into consideration is activity. Besides the Daryl Horcher fight, it's been a long time yep. since we've seen Habib healthy and inside the octagon. That was before when he fought Nurmagomedov. Michael Johnson, on the other hand, has been incredibly active, and he is teeing off on Habib right now. Nurmagomedov, Joe, to your point, was out almost two years. Yeah, it was a long time and a bunch of pretty significant injuries where he couldn't really train that well. Oh, he tapped him. He hurt him back. And again. Nurmagomedov is hurt right now. He's wobbly and hurt. He's, He's moving around. around. The hand he speed of Michael Johnson. But Nurmagomedov is still in trouble, Mike. His legs are not under him completely. And he connects again. And there's the shot. Johnson defends. And Michael Johnson has very good takedown defense, and that will be a big factor in this fight. But he's fighting a different kind of grappler here tonight. Habib Nurmagomedov mauls people. It's the best way to describe his style. And when he gets a hold of people, it almost seems like they're shocked at how strong he is. Look at this, he's yeah, moving right now to the mounted crucifix, and he positions it perfectly, and Johnson is in terrible trouble here. Yep, this is a spot. A horrible position to be in with an elite grappler like Nurmagomedov. Johnson cannot wait here, he must explode. He's got to twist and pop and posture up, but Nurmagomedov maintains an excellent position. He's in side control here. You know that Johnson has trained escapes from this position, but until you're in this position with Habib Nurmagomedov in a real fight, you don't know how difficult it may be. It's a different guy. I mean, but he's it's a mandatory. world champion. Yep. World champion grappler. Completely different kind of guy. It's very hard to find training partners that can replicate what Habib Nurmagomedov can do, unless you're training with someone who's as good as him, and there's just not that many people. And Habib right now is teeing off on Michael Johnson. Like terrible finding position a guy for Joe Johnson. to emulate Rumble. Johnson's getting hurt. He's Habib getting hurt bad here. Trying to posture up. Massive passes. pressure. Massive pressure. He's going to slice that right knee through. And Johnson, with a minute and a half to go, is in full survival mode here, Mike. And this Joe came right after Johnson had hurt Nurmagomedov. Yeah, he hurt him, but was not able to capitalize on that. Took his time, and now he finds himself getting pounded on. Big shots to the temple. Michael Johnson's in a lot of trouble here, Mike. Number go man off 23 and oh. He's gonna mount him, and now Johnson's really doomed. This is terrible. Two-time Russian combat sambo, two-time world sambo champion. Johnson is in big, he just got clipped hard on the chin there. He's in big trouble here, Mike. This fight is in danger of being yep. stopped. Big John McCarthy right on top of the action. He's got to hold on to the hands of Nurmagomedov. He can't just cover up like this. But Nurmagomedov is doing such a good job of tying up his left leg that Johnson can't Vicious. move. I mean, can he, can he absorb this for 30 more seconds is the question. And how diminished will he be if he even makes it out of this round? 20 seconds. Look how Nurmagomedov is tying up that right arm as well. Johnson is effectively only defending himself with one hand, and he can't move his body. This is a terrible place to be for Johnson. Ten seconds. 
Nurmagomedov all over him, but it looks like Johnson is going to make it to the bell. Wow! Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And Big John's taking a real good look at Michael Johnson, and he's happy with what he sees, and he moves away. But man, he got mauled. Because he spent a lot of energy there. Uh-huh. Really. Realize. You were doing great, but a little bit overreaching with your with your punches. Yeah. You forget your feet, and then you're gonna get taken down. You need to put your feet first, and then your hands. Yes, sir. Okay, Rashad. Hey, Michael, on the inside, on the fence. Do not let him get. Do not let him get that lockup. Do not let yeah. him get the full lockup on you. Exactly. When you feel when you feel him going inside, dig deep and keep your elbow tight like this. Hey. Elbow's got to be tight against your body hey. Hey, the whole listen. time. Your steps must be hey. better. Just feet work. Your feet work is good. Okay. Let him reach. Let him reach. Listen. Stay strong. Show him. Hey, Stay strong. At his chest. And then you're gone. Step back. Both you step back. You ready? Let's get up. I think it's imperative that Michael Johnson keep this fight on the feet, maintain his distance, keep a low stance, and be real careful about letting Habib Nurmagomedov get a hold of him. Obviously, easier said than done. Johnson still dangerous. Yep. Look to throw a left hand there on Nurmagomedov, but he's got to be real careful with reaching and making things obvious because if Nurmagomedov times him. Which is what Henry Hoop said in his corner between rounds, Joe. Well, you see Nurmagomedov posturing up straight and then looking to drop down low. Exactly. I mean, he had such a dominant round yep. in terms of grappling. I can't imagine he's not going to do that again. Pushes him up against the cage and immediately gets that. Oh, that well very done. nicely done by Johnson. Very nicely done. He needs more of that for sure. The question is, how diminished is Michael Johnson from those punches he took and from the amount of effort that he had to put out to defend himself? Beautiful sprawl there from Johnson. Greg Jones, Henry Hooft. Greg Jones, Look the wrestling this. coach. Guillotine attempt from Michael Johnson. Sugar Rashad watching closely. He does not have it. Nurmagomedov out. Johnson in full guard. Not good. Terrible is a better word. Just look how quickly he hopped yep. over that and into the crucifix position. Oh, man, look at that. He trapped him with his legs. Just so much control by Nurmagomedov. And Big John's taking a real good look at him and could easily stop this fight. Look how he's done this. I mean, he's switching back and forth from crucifix to a very weird position where he's got the legs trapping the head and arm in place. And he's going to do it again, and he's punching in between his legs. And Michael Johnson just really does not have an answer to the grappling. Is this the owner of the best ground and pound in the game today? Well, one of them for sure, and maybe the best grappler in the game today. Maybe the most dominant, and again, in one of the most talent stacked division, this guy mauls everybody. And it's just the way he does it, no one else does that to these guys. The way he did it to Rafael Dos Anjos, the way he's doing it right now to Michael Johnson, it's like, it's almost like he's a couple of weight classes bigger than them, but it's not a size thing. It's a technique and a grappling strength thing. Oh, and these hard, hard shots. shots yeah. And again, look how he ties up that right arm. He's done it again. Same position. Wraps up that right arm tight, has awesome wrist control, controls the position, and is just mauling him with that left hand. This may be it here soon. Well, it's just a matter of how much Johnson can take. I mean, these are hard shots. I mean, he's throwing his whole body into them. Look how he's digging into that left hand. And Johnson just absorbing him, trying to tough it out, and trying to find the opportunity to move to a better position. But in the meantime, getting severely diminished, severely diminished with every punch Nurmagomedov lands. And there's another one. Michael Johnson, one. man, showing some guts. Showing an amazing chin, too. Yeah. 
which just got tested. I mean, he's getting pounded on, Mike. This is really horrific. It really is. And look how Habib has just got him contorted. I mean, he can barely, he gets you in a, in a position where you can barely defend yourself. Wow, look and, at that number. And Johnson cannot hold him the way he holds Johnson. When Johnson grabs a hold of his wrist, Habib just pulls it away from him. I mean, the grappling strength is just so apparent. Can he get to round three? 45 seconds. Oh, those shots landing big time. Well, what's been interesting in this fight, not just watching the domination from Habib Nurmagomedov, Man. but the fact that Michael Johnson was able to hurt him in the first round. Yep. That's what opponents, future opponents, will look to. But they also have to be aware of what Habib Nurmagomedov to do to you. Trying to get the finish here late in round two. And Johnson almost back up at his feet, but now Habib's still all over him. Ten seconds. You cannot doubt the heart of Michael Johnson here. Just really incredible heart being displayed. Undeniable. Will he make it? Yep. Relax, up, breathe. Relax, relax, relax there. Get to breathing, baby, get to breathing. Relax. Listen, listen good to me, Michael Johnson. You're not listening. You hit him great with the knee. Don't go for some chokes or some submissions. Hey, yeah, 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 listen. listen. You need to outwork him. You can, you can stay in the mm -hmm. first round. You got, but you reach out with your punches. If you miss with one punch, follow up. Straight punch, go to the body first. Yes, go to the body first, and then you go upstairs. Deep follow with your right hook. Okay. All right, what are you gonna do? Yeah. Good. Gonna do hey. good? Okay. Be careful, we're gonna smash your boy. Yeah. Yes, of course. Let's focus on what we're gonna do here. Okay, let's focus on what we're gonna do. I know who I am. Come on, I know. let's go, let's go. Up, 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 let's go. You good? Step back. Step all the way back. They're talking to each other. I do not know what they're saying. Big John McCarthy just told Rashad Evans, who's in the corner of Michael Johnson, that he's not going to let him take that kind of punishment that he took in rounds one and two here in the third and final round. No one better than Big John. Yeah. And he's very close to the action. He can see that Johnson is trying with everything he has. And I think Big John's just interested in saving him from himself. But this is the problem. We've never seen anybody do this to Michael Johnson before. But this is exactly what we said when Habib fought Rafael Dos Anjos. Yeah, we said we've never seen anybody do this to Rafael Dos Anjos, right? He does this to almost everybody he gets his hands on. He's a very, very rare talent. Trained by his father for many years. Big John think, right on top of I it. I think Big John can stop this fight at any moment. Yeah. And they... Right there. Look at those numbers. Wow. He's going to stop it. Yep. I mean, this is just, I, I don't see how he can absorb all these shots. I mean, it's incredibly impressive, the heart and the courage that Michael Johnson is showing. But this is not good. Never go met off. Full mount. On top, full mount. More damage. Full mount with the right arm trapped. Do you notice how he does that all the time? He traps arms. He traps arms when he does ground and pound almost exclusively. He's just so good at that. He's looking for an arm triangle. He's pounding the body. Johnson defends it. I mean, I'm very impressed with the heart of Michael Johnson. Very impressed. Man, oh man. He is not giving up. He has had many, many opportunities. Look at this. He's making his way over the top. He's trying so hard. But Habib turns it around. Number Gomedov has to be getting a bit frustrated here. He would think that he has finished his opponent at this point. But Michael Johnson showing the great heart tonight. 
Habib looks like he may be looking for a Kimura on the left arm of Michael. He's looking for the overhook. He's tying it up. That's exactly what he's doing. He's turning the corner. He's going to get it right here. This should be it. Michael should tap, or he's going to break his arm. He's going to break his arm. It is all over. Habib Nurmagomedov moves to 24 and 0. I'm, I'm actually happy that he didn't continue with the ground and pound and decided to submit him there. And I'm happy that Johnson tapped and was able to avoid injury. But man, what a display of dominance by Habib Nurmagomedov. He is a monster. Habib Nurmagomedov just came running over to Dana White and was demanding to get a shot at the title. And after a performance like this, how can you deny this man? I mean, in my opinion, it's him and Tony Ferguson at the top of the heap. Tony Ferguson, who was the number one contender before this fight, I don't know what the ratings would be afterwards. Like, I, walk, I look at that, I'm like, please tap. Just please tap. You're not gonna get out of that. Just, I hate w seeing what happened to Noguera when he fought Frank Mir. The same exact position. Man. Incredible, incredible yep, performance tap. by Nurmagomedov. Yeah, he tapped with the right hand, Joe. Nurmagomedov gets the stoppage in the third round to make it official. The veteran voice, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee John McCarthy's called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 31 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by submission due to Kimura, Habib the Eagle, Nurmagomedov!